Hi, this is a video to show the BC127 throughput with over IAP2 with an iOS device. Uh, we have here the BC127 development board, uh, an iPod running uh, our Melody Classic, and here we are on the Bluetooth menu. And we have here our terminal application to show the uh, communication. We start by adding a device. Here we can select COM10 and the default baud rate for BC for Melody on BC127. So we start, we need to ch change to text, connect, check the clear after send and the carriage return for our test. And we can start by typing status. Here we have commun communication. To get the high throughput, we need to set the baud rate to 9 to 1 600. When we do that, we need to go to settings and change the board rate to the selected board rate. And we can check that was, yeah. And then we need to set the flow control to on so that we can go into transparent mode and again go to settings, enable flow control, and then we can write make sure that we're always in this state. Now on the iPhone, on the iPod, we can see that uh, our device is Blue Creation Data. So we click on it to connect and pair, and you can see the responses coming on the screen. So the pairing is okay, we opened iApp. After that, we can go and open Melody Classic. And here we can see connected, and connect on our side. On the PC or on BC127, we need to go into transparent mode. We go into transparent, go enter. And for our first test, we're gonna send a file from BC127 all the way to uh, the iOS device. We will use the app note for our terminal application. And here you can see the speed for the transfer. And when the when the file is finished, we will give the amount of the time that we that was spent sending the file and the average throughput for sending that file. On the iPod, you can see the data received here. But there will be no showing of the incoming throughput because we are calculating it on the PC. To test the throughput from the iOS down to the PC, we need to switch to the our next screen on the iOS, and that's our speed test. And the speed test will send uh, a randomly generated data down to the to the iOS to the BC127. So we press start, and we have now uh, the output, uh, the ongoing outgoing throughput, which is the average throughput for the sending. And you can see it's converging the longer we let the device, the iOS device, send data to the BC127. Our instant speed is the speed of how the packets that we're sending down to the iOS subsystem. On the PC side, you can see the data arrived, arriving on the BC127 being transported down to the PC. And then we stop and hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you.